Well, gut inflammation is a common condition that affects millions of people worldwide. And there is a special probiotic that I want you to know about as it relates to this inflammation. And it could be a total game changer for you. We're talking about spore-based probiotics. They're also known as soil-based microorganisms. And what makes them so special in an area just of intense research is their ability to survive harsh conditions such as extreme temperatures, high pressure, and harsh stomach acid. Now, this is one of the reasons that they stand out compared to regular probiotics that we're all familiar with. But another reason they've gained so much popularity is the effect that they have on the immune system and its connection to chronic gut inflammation. You see, chronic inflammation is a root cause in most, if not all, disease. And this is why it's so important to not only identify chronic inflammation, obviously in the gut, but also to take the steps that are necessary to get this inflammation under control. And that's one of the things that I'm gonna talk about in today's video. Now, if you or a loved one is suffering with obesity or atherosclerosis or type two diabetes or mental health problems or an autoimmune disease, you probably don't think that inflammation in the gut has much to do with these health problems. But this gut immune inflammation and metabolic connection is one of the hottest areas of research today. Well, hey there, I'm Dr. Hagmeyer and I wanna welcome you to my channel. Uh, today's video hits on an important topic that I think many people with chronic health problems are really struggling with and don't know where to turn. And so in today's video, I wanna share with you some information on a very special uh, probiotic called a soil-based probiotic or spore-based probiotics. What they do, uh, why they're important when you have chronic inflammation, and really how these special probiotics can really change your health. So as I mentioned earlier, chronic inflammation often starts in the gut. And this inflammation is intimately connected to our immune system. Within our GI tract is a world within a world. There is a delicate balance of microorganisms, including bacteria and yeast. And when the gut microbiome is disrupted, we call this intestinal dysbiosis or just simply gut dysbiosis. And this gut dysbiosis can have far reaching effects throughout our entire body. You see, intestinal dysbiosis leads to an overactive immune response and with that comes chronic inflammation. While traditional probiotics have shown tremendous benefit, soil-based probiotics add another dimension of gut support to what we already have in our toolbox. And this addition is so important. So if you're not familiar with soil-based or spore-forming probiotics, you might be wondering what they are and what makes them so unique. Okay, so it may sound a little odd, but soil-based probiotics, AKA spore-forming probiotics, are derived from the natural environment. And primarily, believe it or not, they're found in soil, they're found in dirt. And they are unique because they have a protective spore layer that enables them to survive these harsh conditions, such as temperature fluctuations and even the hydrochloric acid in our stomach. And this is really one of the reasons why they're so beneficial. Once in the intestines, these spores transform into metabolically active bacteria, and they become activated when there's inflammation. Gut inflammation can start up for a variety of reasons. Maybe you have a poor diet. Maybe you have endured emotional trauma and stress. Maybe uh, you have a history of infections. Perhaps your gut is inflamed from the medications that you're taking, or maybe your gut is uh, unbalanced because you have you know a disproportionate amount of good versus bad bacteria regardless this inflammation can trigger an immune response that leads to the release of inflammatory molecules these inflammatory molecules can damage the gut lining and compromise the gut mucosal barrier the integrity this in turn will now allow harmful substances to enter the bloodstream leading to systemic inflammation and just a range of gut-related disorders. Soil-based probiotics are here for the rescue, right? One of the benefits of soil-based probiotics, of course, has to do with gut inflammation, right? Soil-based probiotics have demonstrated powerful anti-inflammatory properties by really regulating the immune response in the gut. These probiotics can help balance the production of something known as cytokines, which are inflammatory molecules. Studies have shown that soil-based probiotics can decrease the levels of interleukin-6 and decrease something known as TNF-alpha. And 
Here's why that's important to you, right? These cytokines are associated with oxidative stress. They're associated with damage to the tissue, the lining of the gut. Soil-based probiotics help restore the balance of the gut microbiome by controlling those cytokines. You see, we know that when the gut microbiome is imbalanced, this contribute to inflammation. And because soil-based probiotics can be delivered to the areas of the gut where they're needed the most, they in turn can help dampen down and restore balance back to the gut, reducing uh, harmful growth of bacteria as well as inflammation. These probiotics such as bacillus strains produce antimicrobial peptides that can selectively target disease-causing bacteria, but at the same time maintain the diversity of all the good bacteria in our gut. Soil-based probiotics also enhance the function of the gut barrier. The gut barrier serves as the first line of defense against harmful toxins and disease-causing bacteria. And this gut bacteria, or this gut barrier rather, is home to specialized cells like mucin that make secretory IgA. And I've talked about this in past videos. Soil-based probiotics have been found to enhance that gut barrier function. They've been found to increase the, the uh, tight junction proteins. They've been shown to act as gatekeepers of this gut barrier. Again, these tight junction proteins, they maintain the integrity of the gut lining by preventing the entry of harmful substances within the gut. And in essence, they prevent the gut from becoming leaky. Well, here again, soil-based probiotics also help regulate the immune response. If you remember what I said just a moment ago, really at the beginning of this video, I was talking about chronic inflammation. And I said that an overactive immune response in the gut can trigger chronic inflammation. Again, soil-based probiotics have immune modulatory and immune regulating properties, meaning that they can help balance the immune system's response. And again, they do this in part by the production of very specialized immune system cells known as regulatory T cells. These regulatory T cells are incredibly important for people that have autoimmune diseases. With chronic inflammation comes high levels of oxidative stress and free radical production. And again, due to soil-based probiotics, their antioxidant properties, soil-based probiotics have been shown to help minimize the damaging effects of oxidative stress and free radical damage, which ultimately leads to tissue damage throughout our body. These probiotics can increase the levels of antioxidant enzymes, such as superoxide dismutase and glutathione peroxidase, again, supporting the gut's defense against inflammation. And lastly, regulation of mucin production. Now, if you've seen some of my other videos, I've talked a lot about the importance of this mucus layer of the gut. But here's the thing, the gut relies on this protective layer of mucin to prevent the attachment of harmful bacteria in the gut, in the gut lining. Mucin forms not only a physical barrier, but also an immunological barrier. And if you're someone who's had a functional stool test, maybe you had low levels of secretory IgA, where again, that relates to the mucus. Soil-based probiotics have been shown to enhance the production of mucin, which in turn increases uh, the integrity of that mucus barrier and reduces the risk of inflammation and bacteria attaching to those membranes. Okay, so here's what you need to remember about today's video. I know I talked about a lot of different things. It should be pretty obvious that soil-based probiotics provide so many benefits when we suffer with chronic inflammation. Again, their unique properties, including their ability to survive stomach acid, their ability to not be affected by antibiotics, allows them to influence our immune response when other probiotics can't. So this combined ability uh, allows us to restore that gut microbiome, improve our gut barrier function, increase those secretory IgA levels, reduce leaky gut, and really ultimately makes them a powerful addition and powerful tool in promoting gut health. When you incorporate these soil-based probiotics into a comprehensive gut health regimen, meaning a healthy diet and lifestyle, this is going to go a long way at improving not only your digestive health, but also your mental health and every other facet of health that's tied into this gut immune inflammatory connection. Well, that's gonna wrap up today's video. If you have experience with soil-based probiotics or a comment 
uh, that you want to add, drop that in the comment section below. I love reading through these comments and often I do my best to try to respond and add to the dialogue. Now, if you enjoyed learning about the benefits of spore-based probiotics as it relates to inflammation, here's another video that I recommend that you watch.